in order to visualize the 3D networks in their environment, without having to transfer them into the 3D model, quickly generate the surrounding architectural elements using the Autofluid tool. For this video, let's switch to a tight viewport mode. After having set the floors different levels, slabs, false floors, false ceilings, etc., this command will allow you to create 3D walls, slabs, false ceilings, beams and posts. Run the command, click on the first line, be it a line, a polyline, a spline or an element from an XREF. Then choose the appropriate element to click next. If this element is parallel to the first one, you'll immediately get a wall. First line, second parallel line and validate. Once again, right click to validate. This is it for the walls. Let's rebrown the command. Click on the first line. If the second element is not parallel to it, turn clockwise and select the lines that will define the outline. Here we want to create the upper and lower slab. Validate. For a full ceiling example, let's draft a more complex outline. The intersections of the selected elements will define the outline. Use the same method for the dropped beams. Select the elements that will define the outline and enter the drop value. For a rectangular post, same as for the walls, select two parallel elements and validate. It's even quicker for a circular post. Simply click on a circle. 